Warning, if y'all don't like negative comments about Kingdom Hearts, here's your warning. Three, two, one. So let's be honest, Kingdom Hearts fans are fucking crazy. And I've known this for years because every time there's a new game or any type of something announced, we fucking cry. Like we're like drug addicts and like because Kingdom Hearts takes forever to release. And I mean forever. Like there's a good time like gap between like one to two, two to chain of memory, and so on. It's like anytime we get some type of like new release, we fucking cry, celebrate, and fucking show the whole fucking world. And you're all probably wondering why am I talking about this video? Because Sora is in Smash. October or was it October fifth? He got announced for Smash, and the world fucking rejoiced like the fucking Jesus was coming down to Earth. And I want to talk about like my experience with Kingdom Hearts. I've played somewhat of the first one. I religiously beat two, and then I think when I was like ten, my mom bought me the PSP, which you guys remember. You guys remember the PSP? Um, she bought me Birth by Sleep, which I love that one, and I I stupidly love Aqua. She's Bay. But yeah, like we're fucking crazy. Like, there's a lot of like like Pokemon. Yeah, we're bad, but like Digimon has its own little quiet section. Naruto and Dragon Ball, they're, we don't even talk about them. Um, without someone being like, oh, Goku's the fucking best. But, like, Kingdom Hearts fans, we fucking cry. And, like, I, I'm not gonna lie. I watched the Nintendo or the Smash Direct, and I, I teared up, too. Because it only makes sense to put Sora into Smash. Because the kind of game he's in where it's, like, bringing Disney and anime-ish type action style together, I mean... You're not going to see that anywhere else. And the story is, like, confusing as fuck, but I still fucking love it. Um, and because of that, it's a celebration. It's a celebration. Like, Kingdom Hearts fans are, like, happy. Like, we, we, we knew about this rumor. But we never thought it would come true until we saw it. So, like, right when you saw it, it's like, oh, let's go. But yeah, Sora's finally here. And, like, we're happy. Like, we're excited um, this is not just a celebration because now Switch fans are able to like play Kingdom Hearts, which I will get to later on in the video. So, but hey guys, so I know we're talking about Kingdom Hearts and Sora and all that good shit, but I want to say thank you to Raise Energy. You know, um, they sent me. I'm just gonna show you all. They sent me. That's one. You know, it couldn't be continuing. Two. As y'all can see. They send me a lot. And um, I'm going to try out their top secret flavor. So, cheers. Oh my god, that's so good. That's really refreshing. Um, so guys, I'm going to put a link at the end of this video. Please check out Ray's Energy Drink. And thank you so much, Ray's, for sending me this package. And I'm looking forward to working with y'all and talking more about y'all. It's almost like cotton candy. And now we're at the segment where I talk about Kingdom Hearts playing the Switch. How I feel about it, um, I don't know. I don't need. I don't think the Switch can handle it. Maybe the newer, newer Switch. But it's getting every single game, and it's going to be on the cloud. So like, it's a streaming type game. It's not like you have the full game right there. 
I think it's an interesting system, but at the same time, you guys are going to be able to like relive the series, which is a game I religiously played growing up. You have to believe. Um, I I love the concept of Goofy and Donald like being friends with Sora and all that. Um, so the fact that you guys are able to take Kingdom Hearts one, two, three, and then all the others put ten thousand games in between. Um, I I hope you guys enjoy the journey as much as I did. I don't mean, care what he said to you. I'll be there. And I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if Switch they does release some type of special the edition. Of Once we like, go through, there's no you know, it, it's Nintendo Switch. They're gonna release any type of special. Like Olivia. Nintendo wants your money. So, Sora. And right, sure enough, I'm probably gonna buy this. <laughs> you know, I already have no the whole series on my PlayStation. I have it on my Xbox. And because I'm a fucking Kingdom Hearts crackhead, I'm gonna like buy this, this right. one too. Three of us. And like, that's what sucks. Like, it's they they re-release every game. But the game is so iconic to the point where it's that fucking good. It's like a McRib. If you like McRibs, when it comes back, people get excited. They all buy them. That's just King Hearts. And God damn it, Nintendo! I'm trying to pay rent now. I'm gonna have to buy this shit. So like, comment, subscribe on this video, and I have a fucking problem. <laughs>